Rolls-Royce, the world's most exclusive automobile manufacturer, requires no introduction. Rolls-Royce is synonymous with luxury. It has recently entered the electric vehicle market and presented its first electric vehicle, the Spectre. Rolls-Royce, a BMW-owned company, intends to become an all-electric brand by 2030, and the Spectre is a first step in that direction. The Spectre already appears to be a success. Torsten Mullerfoss, CEO of the British luxury brand, recently announced that the business is already considering boosting the production target for its premier EV. Demand has proven to be much better than anticipated. While Tesla and Lucid are cutting costs right now, Rolls-Royce has discovered that there is still a strong demand for premium-priced EVs. Molitures told journalists during a conference call that he was startled by the need for his company's first battery-powered model. In this video, we are going to talk about the expanding interests of Rolls-Royce in the electric car segment. But first, let's look at the history of Rolls-Royce motor cars. Rolls-Royce Motor Cars Limited is a British luxury automotive manufacturer that has been the exclusive manufacturer of Rolls-Royce branded motor cars since 2003 as a wholly owned subsidiary of BMW Edge. The administrative and production headquarters of the company are located on the Goodwood Estate in Goodwood, West Sussex, England. Rolls-Royce Motors manufactured and marketed automobiles under the Rolls-Royce brand from 1906 to 2003. Besides briefly supplying components and engines, BMW Egg's Rolls-Royce motor cars business has no direct link with Rolls-Royce branded vehicles made before 2003. According to the BBC, Rolls-Royce is arguably one of the world's most recognized icons, and the word Rolls-Royce entered the English language as a superlative. According to a 1987 marketing poll, only Coca-Cola was a more well-known brand than Rolls-Royce. Since 2003, Rolls-Royce Motor Cars Limited has been producing Rolls-Royce branded vehicles. The Rolls-Royce brand has been used since 1906, but its fate diverged between 1998 and 2003. In 2003, the Rolls-Royce Motor Cars subsidiary of BMW AG, which had previously been a significant supplier to the brand, began producing vehicles using the Rolls-Royce name. Volkswagen Edge purchased the Bentley brand as well as prior Rolls-Royce manufacturing facilities. Torsten Müller-Thevos, the company's current CEO, began in January 2010, promising to restore the high standards that made Rolls-Royce famous. Sales in China surged 600% that year, making it the company's second largest market behind the United States. The Phantom, a four-door saloon first offered in 2003, as well as its extended wheelbase two-door coupe and convertible variants. The smaller Ghost four-door saloon, Wraith two-door coupe, Dawn convertible, the Cullinan SUV, and the forthcoming 2023 Spectre, the first all-electric Rolls-Royce, are among the company's vehicles. The budding interest. It's no surprise that Rolls-Royce has ventured into electric vehicles. EVs are a no-brainer for the classic luxury brand, because of their quiet and seamless operation, fantastic power, and impressive technology. According to Torsten Mullerto's statements to Car Magazine, customer demand was the proper incentive that enticed the company. Customers have been requesting an electric Rolls-Royce for years, according to the CEO, especially since they already owned EVs from other manufacturers. While Rolls-Royce management had qualms about the shift to electric, such reservations were immediately dispelled when reservations for the company's first EV, the Spectre, were quickly filled more than a year before deliveries began. Rolls-Royce has begun an unusual expansion of its Goodwood manufacturing facility. The premium automaker intends to include a new paint facility in the expanded space and increase overall EV production. This move is remarkable because the company's products are extremely limited in quantity, often limited to a few hundred cars. The CDO feels that an electric Cullinan SUV, Ghost Sedan, and even the top-of-the-line Phantom Sedan are on the horizon while retaining Rolls-Royce's unique luxury touch, or while maintaining what Rolls-Royce stands for. As previously stated by 2030, 
all Rolls-Royce vehicles will be electric. According to the CEO, the British automaker's link to electromobility goes much beyond its first model, which debuted at the end of last year. Company founders Henry Royce and Charlie Rolls not only invented some of the world's first electric vehicles in 1900, but notably foresaw the technology's return, claiming that the electric car is noiseless and pure. There is no odor or vibration, and they should be beneficial once dedicated charging stations are established. That you have your sights set on Rolls Most Royce's anticipated premium EV. It is definitely a beauty on wheels. Let's move on and learn some more fascinating facts about this amazing Rolls Royce EV. Don't forget to like and share the video with your friends. Subscribe to our channel for more EV related stuff right there on EV Scene. Let us now introduce you to the world's most luxurious electric vehicle, Spectre. When one thinks of Rolls Royce, one imagines an automobile with a characteristic Rolls Royce design, such as a tall bonnet, a sleek profile, and a fast back tail. The look of the Spectre is similar, although it is significantly larger than a full size SUV. Rolls Royce, like other automobiles in the EV market with innovative designs, has decided to construct the car in its traditional form, making it a successor to the Phantom Coupe. The Spectra sits atop the giant aero optimized wheels ever placed on a two door Rolls Royce Coupe, measuring 23 inches. Although Rolls Royce used restraint when developing the Spectre, the inside and exterior of the car are in Rolls Royce's contemporary design, which retains the traditional shape influenced by the coach building era of the cars. As a result, the vehicle lacks a large pillar to pillar touchscreen. The car's architecture is two decades old. The car manufacturer claims that the architectural design was developed with future vehicle electrification in mind. The Spectre is larger than the four door Mercedes EQS. The car measures 5.45 meters in length and more than 2 meters in breadth, and it will have the largest grille ever seen on a Rolls Royce vehicle. The large, albeit opaque grille and the spirit of ecstasy perched above it are also iconic Rolls Royce design elements. Nonetheless, the car weighs over 3 tons and will be 30% stiffer than any previous Rolls Royce model. According to the company, the car's design was influenced by the current yacht concept. The overall impact of the design and the car's sheer weight will allow it to glide over any rough surface. It also has a starlit roof. The vehicle also boasts starlit door pads and a screen on the dashboard that houses Rolls' latest Royce's software platform. It's a stereotypical design with a boxy but luxurious body, recognized aerodynamically inspired wheels, and a standard Rolls-Royce chassis. The Spectre will be underpinned by the architecture of luxury platform that has long supported the Phantom, Cullinan, and Ghost cars, which are well-known Rolls-Royce builds.